In Bukidnon, 50 housing units were turned over last week to families affected by typhoon shedding. Apipa Bagumbaran has the story. Presidential Communications Operations Office Secretary Martin Andanat and Department of Social Welfare and Development Secretary Rolando Bautista turned over 50 housing units to families affected by Typhoon Chedeng in Barangay Iba, Kabanglasang Town in Bukidnon under the Government's Poor Shelter Assistance Program. The turnover of the housing units as well as other government projects in Kabanglasan such as Shared Service Facilities and Comprehensive Agrarian Reform Program of DTI, IP Housing Project of NHA, Integrated Livelihood Program and Emergency Employment Program of DOLE, School Building Project of DEPED, and Water System Project of DILG, among others, highlighted the launching of the Convergence Areas for Peace and Development o CAPDEV of Northern Mindanao. CAPDEV, which takes on a whole of a nation approach, is the banner program of the region to address the root causes of internal armed conflict and insurgency. Andanar, who is also designated as the Cabinet Officer for Regional Development and Security for Region 10, also presided the Joint Regional Development Council and Regional Peace and Order Council meeting at Maraybalay City where he witnessed the awarding of checks totaling 1.25 million pesos to 24 rebel returnees under the Enhanced Comprehensive Local Integration Program or ECLIP. The two councils also approved the proposed structure, composition, and implementing mechanisms of the Regional Task Force to End Local Armed Communist Conflict or RTFL PAC, which will operationalize President Duterte's Executive Order No. 70. Region 10 is the first region in Mindanao to launch a program and craft a framework in response to AO70. For PNA Newsroom, Atipa Bagumbaran of Philippine Information Agency.